A lot of people were wondering uh, when news first came about the passing of Mrs. Carter if uh, the former president would be in attendance. And so I think a lot of people are very heartened to see that he will be at the services today. And um, uh, certainly a lot of people thinking of him, mm -hmm. especially after 77 years of marriage, which is something that most people never lived to see. Yeah, can only dream of. Yeah. And I think one of the things also special about today's service, if you look at the program, is that even though we have all these dignitaries, it still is going to feel like a family service. We talked about the uh, grandchildren being the pallbearers. Also, as a part of this service, we know that uh, Mrs. Carter's son, James Chip Carter the third, he's going to be there to welcome attendees. Uh, the daughter, Amy Carter, will be there presenting a reading, one of their grandsons uh, reading scriptures. So even though you have all these world dignitaries, it's the family uh, they wanted this to still feel like a family service to honor their loved one. And I think that's special as well. It certainly is. We are still waiting uh, for the body of Mrs. Carter to be moved inside of the church for that service to begin. It was again transferred from the Carter Center earlier in the day. Uh, we know that this is going to be a, a very moving tribute today. Jonathan, you were just mentioning some of the things. We also know that longtime friends, country legends Garth Brooks and Trisha Yearwood will um, offer a performance during today's ceremony. And so a lot of people uh, across the world really just wanting to be a part of today's service. And so while we know that this is private and invitation only, we're happy that we are able to at least get a glimpse um, from inside. We're seeing right now Governor Brian Kemp and First Lady Marty Kemp followed by Atlanta Mayor Andre Dickens entering the church right now. Again, this is Glenn Memorial Church on Emory University's campus. We see them entering uh, right now. So that might be a sign that we are getting even closer mm -hmm. to the start of this event. We see there are still quite several, quite a few rows that are empty right now. 